Is it time to buy or sell Mullen Automotive stock? In this video, we're diving deep into Mullen Automotive. Our initial report was published on our website on Monday, June 5, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Boost your experience by joining our YouTube membership. Choose the supporter tier to show your appreciation with a loyalty badge or the trader tier to request video analysis of the company of your choice. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since February 16, 2023, our system has ranked Mullen Automotive as a strong sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 7.49. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock experienced a loss of minus 90.44%. This translates to an average loss of minus 1.21% per day since it was listed as strong sell candidate. The stock has broken the very wide and falling short-term trend up. Firstly a slower falling rate is indicated, but this may very well be an early signal of a trend shift. On the reaction, there will be support on the roof of the current trend broken which is $0.636, a level that may pose a second chance to hit a runner. According to Fan Theory, $1.76 will be the next possible trend top level and thereby pose a resistance level that may not be broken at the first attempt. The current three-month trend suggests a potential minus 85.62% change over the next three months, with a possible return between minus 100% and minus 86.87%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 95.07% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 100% and minus 89.79%. This translates to a price range of $0 to $0.0712 after a year. Our latest daily update for Mullen Automotive includes the headline, Mullen Automotive stock price fell more than minus 6.68% Monday closing at $0.697. The Mullen Automotive stock price fell by minus 6.68% on the last day, Monday, June 5, 2023, from $0.747 to $0.697. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 8.02% from a day low at $0.680 to a day high of $0.735. The price has fallen in 7 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 34.86% for this period. Volume has increased on the last day by 13 million shares but on falling prices. This may be an early warning and the risk will be increased slightly over the next couple of days. In total, 29 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $20.21 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $42.75 and the lowest price was $0.680. Currently, the price is 98.37%, or $42.05, below the 52-week high, and 99.82%, or $396.80, below the all-time high on November 17, 2021, when the price reached $397.50. Analysts have given Mullen Automotive stock a general buy rating. They rate the P-E ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a strong sell rating. The following signals have been identified for Mullen Automotive. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The Mullen Automotive stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $0.776 and $1.47. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Friday, March 31, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 78.77%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume rose on falling prices yesterday. 
This may be an early warning and the stock should be followed more closely. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, sell signal 45 days ago. Bollinger, by signal not applicable days ago. Short-term moving average, by signal 25 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal not applicable days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Holds a sell signal. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, by signal 32 days ago. The long-term moving average, sell signal 76 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. By signal 70 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for Mullen Automotive There is no support from accumulated volume below today's level and given the right condition the stock may perform very badly in the next couple of days. This stock may move very much during the day, volatility, and with a very large prediction interval from the Bollinger Band this stock is considered to be very high risk. During the last day, the stock moved $0.0546 between high and low, or 8.02%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 11.8%. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for Mullen Automotive. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Mullen Automotive is at $0.759. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. There's no significant support from accumulated volume below, which means the stock could potentially drop sharply under certain conditions. Proceed with caution and consider placing bets only if you're an experienced trader who knows how to navigate such situations. The combined average rating for Mullen Automotive from multiple analyst sources is buy. Let's take a look at some recent insider trades. On March 6, 2023, Braggett O'Chester A. conducted an insider buy of zero shares of. On March 6, 2023, New Jonathan conducted an insider sell of 159,066 shares of common stock. On January 6, 2023, New Jonathan conducted an insider buy of 159,066 shares of common stock. On February 16, 2023, Mishiri David conducted an insider sell of 5 million shares of common stock. On February 16, 2023, Mishiri David conducted an insider sell of 1 million shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, we've calculated the insider power to be positive with a ratio of 40.421. Overall, Insiders purchased 169,709,031 shares and sold 62,719,587 shares in the last 100 trades. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and no stop loss has been set. Is Mullen Automotive stock a good buy? Mullen Automotive holds several negative signals and is within a very wide and falling trend, so we believe it will still perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. We therefore hold a negative evaluation of this stock. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a sell to a strong sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Tuesday, June 6, we expect Mullen Automotive to open up $0.0071 and start trading at $0.704. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe.
We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.